Marnie Hammond has been waiting for this day. Last night we actually put up balloons and put up banners. We're excited for Daddy. Her husband Max is finally coming home from Afghanistan. Try to keep it different every week and just make the time go by fast. But as she waits for his arrival, she can't help but worry about their future. It's very scary to think of cuts that happen in the military. She's talking about sequestration. Congress can't allow the sequester to happen. The same conversation taking place in downtown San Diego. As the deadline continues to loom in Washington, millions of jobs hang in the balance. At the end of last year, um, the sequestration threatened about 30,000 jobs just in the military sector in our county. Congressman Scott Peters says, not only will the sequester affect military, but it will also cut deep into other sectors and into our economy. If we let the sequester go into effect, that that cuts about 3% out of our GDP. And if you think we've only been, we've only been growing at a less than 2% a year, that's uh, a big setback.